it's a four-seater tourer. Uh, um, there's only 13 known to exist at the moment, the civilian tourers. There are some WD army, ex-army ones, which they made until 1942, which you often see on Dad's Army and programs like that. Uh, and one, one film I've seen where the Queen is servicing one. She's got the bonnet up, working on one when she was in the ATS, I suppose, during the war, you know. Um, it's eight horsepower, four-seater. They did make a two-seater, but there's none known to exist, no two-seaters. Uh, I bought the car from a chap in Billericay who had a private museum. It wasn't a runner, it was just a museum piece. It didn't go at all, and I've done all the work on it. That was since 19, 1990 I bought it, seven years ago. Um, I always wanted to get another one of these when I could have, you know, when I got older, because my very first car was an Austin 8, an XWD one, in 1951, which I kept for nine years. Uh, until the first uh, kiddie came along, we got married, and the first kiddie came along, it was too drafty to have a Cali car on the back seat, so we sold it for £50 in those days. Um, then later on in life, I, I wanted to acquire one, so I put a wanted advert in a paper, and that's how I, I acquired it. This chap had one in a museum, which wasn't a runner. It was a pretty bad state, you know. Um, and I've worked on it ever since. I've still do a bit each year on it, but it's been on the road every year since, since I bought it.